HK, bro. Hello, I am Rebecca Ivana Blackman, and I will be your moderator for today's debate. Dump Trump. And on our panel today, we will have Dexter Buckus of HP News. We will have Billy Ray Bootlicker of the Mayberry PD. And we will have Hockmit Habibi of the 7-Eleven down the street. Okay, Donald Trump and Stormy Daniels, the porn star, is becoming the nation's number one topic. Okay, Dexter, explain to us what you think about the situation. You know, it really doesn't surprise me that a man like that would have to pay for the kitty cat. But the part that is funniest to me is how does she get through him and his tidy whities chasing her? I would have been rolling on the floor laughing. Can you imagine that sight? Ugh. No. I'm wondering how much money it took for him to pay her for her to go down that road. Stu is a loser. Officer Bootlicker. Well, gosh dang it, I really don't understand y'all on this man. Because what? He got a little bit of nookie and didn't want to tell his wife? Come on now. How many men out there do that nowadays? Yeah, there's been plenty of men. Go out there and get a little on the side. Wife don't got to know nothing about it. But yeah, y'all want to bring it up. Because he's the president of the old good U.S. of A. Always got something negative to say about the man. He's the greatest man on earth. And if you don't believe him, he tell you himself, I'm great. I'm great. He's just trying to make America white again. He just trying to make America great again. Yeah, that's right. Trying to make it great again. But that's all I'm going to say. Other than, Mr. President, can't let nobody see you in them tighter waters. Not a good look. Hockmit, baby. What is your take? Sir, I am uh, sitting in front of yourself, uh, myself Rakesh Mahanti, and uh, I am uh, technology man. But if you will ask me what is my passion, I will say hardware. But this is for the first time I am doing on Spikey. Uh, I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Did you understand the words that were coming out of my mouth? Let's move on to our next topic. Donald Trump recently wishing him Vladimir Putin a very happy birthday. We're going to start off this time with Officer Bootlicker. Here you go again. I said, here you go again. That man just said a happy birthday to a fellow world leader. You can't just be nice nowadays. It's got to mean something behind it. It's got to mean something world threatening because he said happy birthday. Matter of fact, I'm going to say Happy birthday to old Pootie, myself. Yeah, go, 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 yeah.
Go, 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 shorty. Yeah, yeah. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Go, booty. It's your birthday. You can find me in the club. With poopy in the club. Yeah, that's about as far as I go with crap. Can't stand that garbage. Officer, I think that you're such a huge Donald Trump follower that your name should not be Bootlicker. It should be Ass Kisser. Anyway, let's move on to Hot Mid Habibi. What is your take on the Trump Putin situation? Sir, I am from Jharsugura. Uh, I studied 10th uh, Saraswati Sisu Vidya Mandir, graduate Cambridge Institute, Ranchi, not from England, noted. And I am uh, putting my screwdriver everywhere and seeing what is happening. I am a hidden scientist. Uh, hot mit. I swear I'm not understanding what's coming out of your mouth. I am working with BSNL telephone company. Whenever the line goes off, I ride the telephone comba and make the line good. I need a new job. I can't do this anymore. 